Hey friends, today we're gonna take a look at a card option called use all toggle list and um, for new users of Notion Donkey it might not make sense why would you need an option like this? Well, if you export this page here and import it into Notion to Anki and the upload process and then get it into Anki, it's only gonna create flashcards for the first toggle because it by default only will get it at the top level, right? What's here in the page. That's why you see this here. In order to uh, get the other toggles, you need to enable use all toggle lists. Let's go ahead and import that again. And then bam, and then you can see now we have seven cards. So if we go in the browser, we can take a look at them. So see, the first one is uh, the parent one, right? And then the second one is this one here. And then that's just the close two, so it's the same. And then the next one, and then the last one there. And we can also take a look at it here in the viewer and study it. You can see this is the top level one. And then this one. All right, so yeah, that's uh, how you use the all toggle list feature and um, if you want to go through that uh, of the first one then there's another option for that i'll add the link in the description so i hope that made sense and if you have any questions uh, please do ask in the comments and i'll try to answer you thank you for watching and make sure to like and subscribe bye